how we use the Panama gate. Plus the control the C not gate to create entanglement. Entangled uh, states. So uh, in the quantum computing, the the common way to create uh, the entangled state is to first apply a uh, Adama gate, and then we do a controlled. not gate. This is a common way to create the entanglement. The way, the reason why that's the case, uh, I'm looking at my uh, notes, so, so I'm good, uh, so here's the, so the Hadamard gate, uh, Uh, so initially it starts with the cat zero, cat zero, right? So, and Hadamard gate will, is oh, two, one, one. So when we applied Hadamard gate, uh, so that's what the, the H, the, the H is the Hadamard gate. This is the Hadamard gate, and this is the control the not gate. And that's uh, H is the Hadamard gate. But remember, now we have a two uh, state, two qubit state. So this is the the initial stage is actually zero, zero. So Now, so if we if we apply the Hadamard gate on the two zero zero, this missing something. Uh, it doesn't it doesn't do that. This is on the so the zero zero will be what the uh, zero actually is. Uh, let me see zero zero. is actually zero uh, tensor product. Yeah, there's a there's a confusion here. The tensor product is a symbol and the, by in the Q's case, that symbol is a controlled or not. Uh, I'm not sure whether there's the other way to write a tensor product. Uh, but, so the way to, uh, but this is a bit, uh, uh, it, Let's just keep in mind, in the Q skit, in the Q skit, that's the control the not gate. In the formula, that's the tensor product symbol. So, but the Hadamard gate is actually applied on a single state, single gate. This is a single gate. Mm -hmm. But the system state actually is the two bit. How do we? Describe the Hadamard gate on the two uh, gate system. So, and here is uh, a kind of an ingenious part. We add another, uh, add, just like uh, in uh, come in, in the many of the math um, trick, we just add the one. Well, in complex math, this one is what the so-called identity matrix. So I add that one here, which is uh, this one, 
zero, zero, one. But how do we multiply uh, this? It's actually not a matrix multiplication, it's again a tensor product. So the way this will be written will be uh, Adama gate tensor product of the identity uh, identity gate and then work on the zero zero two qubit state and this uh, so, so basically we can uh, assuming there is a there is an identity there. We multiply a one there. Uh, and so this will be uh I have to look at my notes for this. Uh, two Tensor product one zero zero one. Uh, my apologies, but my handwriting again. Uh, this has to be a much bigger. And this, and then on the zero zero uh two state. Is that correct? Yes, that is correct. Okay, so this can be uh, yes. Yes. So first apply Hadamard gate on the first zero, and this will be first applied Hadamard gate on the first zero, and then apply the identity matrix on the second zero state. And then we will have, and Hadamard gate on the first zero will be And the second part should be zero again. It basically Cut zero again. And the first part will be basically superposition. The first part should be two. That's correct. It should be. And this will become and um, put the tensor in. So that will be the two qubit uh, after uh, this is after applying 
the Hadama gate on the two qubit system. Basically, now two uh, superposition of this. So we actually can use the IBM quantum composer to to see this. Let me see. Uh, so now I'm going to on my desktop. In theory, I could use my iPad to do this as well. Actually, I just realized. Uh, yeah, I do. I, I I could use my iPad to do that, uh, but I, I already have my laptop set up. So okay, so let me uh switch back to my laptop. The next time I'll try to use my iPad to do everything. Uh, so yes, so now uh, so we have two uh, two qubit Q zero Q one. And then, oh wait, that's the control the knot. Well, uh, need to remove this. So we apply Hadamard gate on the first one. Is there identity? Yes, there is identity. So this, so the Hadamard gate H is the Hadamard gate. Uh, it create. Uh, So it basically create a superposition. Uh, it rotate the state cat zero and cat one to plus to north and the south. So, and the, this one is the I. It just should be the identity gate. Yeah, the I gate. Uh, and that's actually basically the when we uh, if we don't. Don't do that. It's also okay. You you can see the same. You got the same result, right? So because that doesn't change anything. So after uh add that, you the first gate is uh either zero or one. So either zero or one, right? So if we do that, if we do that for a second one, it will become a uniform distribution. The, the Q1 will also be, uh, become zero or one. So when the one, 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 zero, the first bit, uh, if you remove the second one, you see the first bit zero and one. If we move this to the second one, the second bit, which is the first, uh, when we the second from right to left, the second bit is now zero and one. So uh, let's move it back and so put I there. And this is basically what uh, we just went through um, Hadama gate plus identity gate on the two qubit, and then we create the superposition, uh, the superposition basically of the Q zero. So, okay, then if we apply the control the not gate. The control not gate with with the the control bit is the zero zero bit uh, Q zero, and the not is applied on Q one. So this is uh, control the not gate, and you can actually see in the QC code is actually called CX control the not gate. Uh, in the in the code. Uh, Hadamard gate, identity gate, CX. We apply CX. So in this case, control is Q0 and target is Q1. Uh, what does this means is uh, if the control is in state of one and then uh, it flipped the, the target gate. If control is zero, then not, nothing happens. Uh, so if the control bit is in the superposition and then it creates entanglement. So Q0, we applied uh, Hadamard gate on Q0. Q0 is now in superposition. And then we applied CX gate. So C, because Q0 in superposition, now we create an entanglement between Q0 and Q1. 
So this is the now let's go back to the uh the actual mathematical foundation to see why that's the case. So let me look at my notes again. Oh, I need to share my iPad again. Uh, okay. Yeah, if I if I always use my iPad, I don't have to flip uh, this anymore. Yeah, I need to next time try to use my iPad to do everything. So okay. So <clears throat> now, so by 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 now, all this is just a. Uh, the first uh, step. So let me try to do this. Step one, edge gate. I don't know. Now step two, uh, let me make this smaller as well. Now we do step two. Which is C controlled not gate. Uh, okay, so the controlled not gate will be the formula is. Uh, This is basically become an if else. So so basically it is the if Q zero is cat what cat one flips q one gate. So what this operation means is C not gate apply on the above uh, superposition. And this actually can be rewritten as So, and then we just apply. Right? So, the first position is a zero, and we don't. We do first position is zero. We don't do anything. So that's is still zero zero. The first position is a zero. We also don't do. Uh, oh, well, I guess the, the, uh, so. Oh, this is just opposite with the uh, with the IBM uh, in the IBM system is. In this case, first bit is this one, uh, is a uh, is the first one. I just realized the uh, IBM system uh, presentation is actually just opposite uh, from right, right to left. Uh, so this one is the first one is zero. So when this one is zero, this is first bit is Q zero is zero. We do not we do nothing. When the first bit is one, we flip it. So this one will be become one one, and this one will remain as zero zero. So there we then we we have
This is Tobika. Hmm. Publisher move this. Uh... Yeah, maybe maybe this is more appropriate. Yeah. Okay. So applying C not gate on the superposition uh, on the uh, superposition of the two qubit system. And then we have this result. Now, what is this result? So why this is the entangled state, basically? Uh, the entangled, basically, we want to see uh, whether this uh, can be the tensor product of individual state. So why is this entangled? And so. So why uh, why this is the entangled state? Uh, this actually, uh, the book and uh, uh, when, I, when I also research on the other resources, there, there are several ways to approach this, to explain why this is entangled. Uh, one way is to show um, this cannot be written as the tensor product of individual state. Basically, in this case, we have a, a um, Q0 or Q1, is there a way that independent state can be, uh, the tensor product of those independent Q0, Q1 can uh, lead to this stage? Uh, apparently, there, is, uh, there are ways to show by proof of a contradiction. So you're using a, a one way to do this you using proof of contradiction. To show this is entangled. Uh, to show this, well, uh, maybe must be this to show Oh, sorry, uh, Hanadi, are you saying something? Oh, I I thought I'm I'm muted. I said entanglement. I, uh, I said I said entanglement. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But but the definition of entanglement, I, I try to. Yeah. To, uh, uh, you you cannot say proof this entanglement. Say this is entangled, right? So yeah. <laughs> you you have to. I'm sorry. Prove, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I, I thought I'm muted. That's I was talking to myself. <laughs> sorry. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, but. Basically, if we say uh, the Earth is flat, we cannot say because the Earth is flat, therefore the Earth is flat, which actually Earth is probably not flat, right? In that way. So anyhow, so the, so, so the, to prove this two is entangled, we actually use proof of contradiction to show uh, uh, that one way is called uh, to show uh, this is not a tensor product product uh, of two uh, in the in, in how, how do I spell individual individual state. Uh, I'm glad I'm using the iPad. I, I run out of space. I have to move this. Q0 and Q1. 
So basically, uh, one way is to prove using the oops, sorry, that's that's not the using the uh, uh, contradiction. So if indeed that's that is the tensor product, one way is to show this will lead to some contradiction. Um, if we use the IBM quantum uh, system, quantum Q sphere. Uh, using the IBM quantum Q sphere. Uh, that's basically is what shows. And that actually shows in the north and the south pole on the Q sphere. So on the Q sphere is actually, uh, gee, uh, I need to learn some art. <laughs> Sorry. This, uh, And this is what uh, shows up on IBM Q sphere. Zero zero, and cat zero is uh, that uh, north, cat one one at the bottom. So this is uh, <clears throat> the uh, entanglement. So. Uh, To be honest, this is not obvious. So <laughs> I actually joked to some of the math friend, uh, <clears throat> the entanglement is not intuitive to us because we, we the mathematician didn't come up with a better tool for us to understand more intuitively. <laughs> Sorry, that's a, uh, I'm just blend uh, uh, our, uh, Friends in the math department for not uh, not offering an easy uh, explanation for this. <laughs> My apology for that. Uh, don't tell our math uh, people. <laughs> so, okay, so that's uh, uh, <clears throat> but we also uh, ex uh, ex in fact uh, in the previous lecture we also tried a different way. So we 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 add a Hadamard gate. Add a control node, we create the entanglement. We try the, the other way around. We apply the control the node gate, then apply Hadamard. It did it, right? So, and then, so the next step, uh, yes, as uh, a comparison, let's do the other part. So, <clears throat> the other part will be uh, now, uh, let me go back to black. Now we add the in this case, we first apply C naught gate and then add the Hadamard gate. This what will how uh this what will not leave to a entangular state, but why? So uh and in this case uh yeah, we do this again. So Q0, Q1. So we first apply the C0 gate. And then we apply the Hadamard gate. This actually will not lead to the entangled state. Why that's the case? Uh, Oh, actually, uh, this is wrong. Well, well, I thought this is already wrong because now these two are controlled, but it's not a one at the bottom anymore. So there, so that's clearly make a difference here. So because that's the controlled, uh, uh, uh not. So it's actually become the. almost applying to the next one again. So it's almost like this. This, the Hadamard gate is now applied on both of them. So what this 
end up doing is basically become educate. Oh, I shouldn't use the red. Uh, and then on the zero zero state. And this actually uh We basically apply all the tensor out. Uh, so this will be one, one, my, my handwriting is terrible. Uh, I'm going to try to write a, a bit slower so it's more uh, readable. Uh, minus one, one, one. Minus one, minus one, one, minus one, minus one, one. And the uh, cat zero, zero will be one, zero. Uh, by the way, this is one of the tricky questions in the exam too. <laughs> so cat zero, zero is actually this. And when you apply the gate and yeah, so uh <clears throat> okay so this and then uh maybe one 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 yes it is one 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 yeah so that's correct. And uh, what this means basically, this also is uh, this is actually a uh, cadero. Yeah, so this is the uh, so this is a basic superposition of all possible two qubit base state with an uh, equal amplitude for every one of them, and that means all possible. So this is means all. Uh, All possible two qubit bases. So which means it is a linear product. So this is not entangled. Yeah, so this is clearly is is the linear uh yeah, is a tensor product of individual state. So, so this is uh, this can be uh, this can be uh, written in tensor product. Of uh, uh, excuse me. Uh, sorry.
individual states. <coughs> so there's actually a Uh, there's actually a textbook also has some uh, uh, a lot of uh, written on this or uh, I probably got it from other source not a textbook because this is uh, we, we we found it by access <clears throat> so this uh and by definition, if it can be a state can be written as a tensor product, it's not an entangled state. So not entangled. So <clears throat> So if we go back to the quantum, uh, IBM quantum circuit, <clears throat> try to see this again. Quantum composer. Oh. <clears throat> so this time we are going to uh, just apply. Yeah. Something is not right. We need another Hadamard gate. I right? guess I do need another Hadamard mm -hmm. gate. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. This is also not right. Uh, yeah. Yeah, this is uniform. Oh, I, I think I... I think it worked. Okay, I think my... uh I, I need to add this more expressively. Okay. <clears throat> now, so this is... Now it is uniform. Mm -hmm. uh, I guess I need to install the, the, that dash one. I just need to add that as the solid one, so... That's the exam. Uh, okay, I think this is also not entangled. Uh, <clears throat> zero, 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 one. But I need to, I didn't have the formula work out to explain about. <clears throat> so my, my example actually is for the, this two had gate applied to the two stage. <clears throat> Uh, <clears throat> I guess if I remove this one, okay, that's also not entangled. Okay. The good the good thing about the quantum composer, we we can try it without going through complicated math trying to figure out, but we can clearly see that. If I <clears throat> and this way. Huh. It's also not. Okay, I have to remove this one. And then you see that. Oh, this is also interesting. I apply two quantum. If both of them superpositioned, it's also not entangled. <clears throat> hmm. Why that's the case? Uh, Okay, this is the another example I haven't worked through. So uh superposition on one, now we have entangled. If both of them are superpositioned, 
it's not entangled. Actually, that seems to make sense. Uh, it basically uh, <clears throat> distributed it now, evenly distributed. But if that's the case, there's no reason why I applied it. Yet. I got the same result. Well, this means that if I apply the control knowledge, it doesn't change the probability of the system. Okay. <clears throat> uh, intuitively, this seems to make sense to me. I'm, I'm, uh, I guess superposition, superposition, uh, then apply the clock, uh, control the knot. It doesn't change the probability. Uh, <clears throat> okay, I guess we could also work on the math uh, formula, trying to try to see that uh, by hand ourselves to to see whether that's in. Oh, this is actually a, another good uh, exercise. I guess we we could go through this. <clears throat> How about I, I put this uh, assignment? Or oh, oh, that be a good idea? Everyone, <laughs> if I if I put uh <clears throat> put this as the homework and uh, uh why uh so the first if we uh, apply Hadamard gate on a Q zero plus C naught we create an entanglement but if we apply the Hadamard gate on both of them then apply C naught then we do not create the entanglement. Uh, why is that the case? Uh, what, what, uh, I can put this uh, assignment, is that a good idea? Uh, well, yeah, we can We can f try to find out what's going on. <laughs> okay, and uh, so I'm, I'm going to... Uh, <clears throat> okay, let me take a screenshot of this. And, 